all right y'all so i'm back with another video excuse my kids in the background all right but anyway i'm back with another video doing a review on these kiss nails i've done it bef done before but i think it was shorter this one is a medium size uh, french tip acrylic press on nails now excuse my hair just don't even worry about that all right so i'm taking it the kit apart and it's so simple and easy i find that doing my own nails saves money and it's just satisfying to me <laughs> and way cheaper okay so you have the little cuticle pusher and then you have a little file and then the glue that comes with the nails excuse my kids they're not gonna let me be great all right so the first thing you want to do is file your nail beds to get the access or off so your uh, glue will stick better okay and excuse me I'm talking to my kids I'm doing all kind of stuff in the background I try to get more videos out but as you can see it's a lot going on that's my little nephew Johnny he's <laughs> oh, look at him he is a hot mess hot hot mess so you want to just file all your nails not file all your nails like buff them get all the excess oil off of them um and then push your cuticles back if you choose to this is optional this step here is optional you can push your cuticles back but you really don't have to if you don't want to okay so um i'm still pushing my cuticles back like i said it's optional you don't have to because sometimes it's kind of like just cringy i don't like to do it all right do and it. so don't do it. after that i'm getting the glue and the nails together in order to um make sure that the nail and the glue the nail is the right size for my nail i'm off all over the place because these kids shh, they just won't let me be great y'all and i'm just i'm sorry i'm gonna have to upload it just like this because it'll take me forever to try to edit it and do all that all right so now you see me gluing the nail um and what i like to do is put nail glue on the nail bed itself and the acrylic nail and then push it down um that helps get air bubbles out it's not going to get all the air bubbles out but the majority of the air bubbles and you can uh see how effortless effortless it is and how it looks professional see isn't that cute now it's not perfect but it'll do all right for 7.99 definitely it will definitely do so i'm gonna continue and i'll come back so now i have all my nails on and see even up close per and personal once you get the hang of it and the more you do it you'll be able to do it without um as many air bubbles showing but like I said, sometimes it does. So I'm showing you right here that it is like an air bubble, like a pocket there where it's not all the way um, down. So those are the nails that I have left over. And all right, I decided it to just go on a walk because I've been saying I'm gonna go on a walk for the longest. So me and my husband decided to walk the track with the kids. Um, that's what I plan on doing. It's a pretty good track. The only thing I don't like it is about the geese or the goose, whatever, over there. They like poop all over the track. So it's like way, way, way disgusting and really, really annoying. Um, so you gotta watch where you step at, of course. So my nails turned out like this. I decided to take a break from it because I wanted to go for a walk, but I also want to show you guys how um i cover up some of the air bubbles okay but of course with the kids i decided to get out of the house i'm also 
my New Year's, one of my New Year's resolution is to exercise more, be more active and healthy, um, eat right. Ever since I've turned 30, over 30, been over 30, it's like yeah, a lot of times it's hard for me. Things that was easy for me to do, it's just not as easy for me to do. I get, I find myself getting tired more easily. I take more naps. Um, I'm gonna go in my room. Hopefully they don't follow me. <laughs> uh, and a lot of times it's just easier for me <laughs> to um, take a nap, go to sleep, and then wake up and do it over again. So, yeah. So, yeah, I'm just walking the track, walking the track. And then you see my daughter, Journey. She told me over and over and over she didn't want a hoverboard for Christmas. Then last minute, she decided she wanted a hoverboard. Well, I had already brought Rodney one and Jeremiah. He got a hoverboard for his birthday, which is Halloween. So they both had hoverboards while we walked the track. And Journey was just being Journey. <laughs> and my husband's way in the back. But, um, yeah, so they liked it. They enjoyed it. The weather was perfect. Florida weather was perfect. Um, yeah, so we did that for a while. And here they come zooming around. I like these little things, but you have to be very careful. You're going to see Jeremiah, like, trips up right here they it just happens so fast and they go so fast and you know you have to have to be careful but they're very fun i can't ride them but all my kids ride them and they enjoy them all right so now i'm back home and i'm showing y'all how i the technique that i use to cover up the air bubbles um this polish is straight from family dollar or dollar general one of them maybe even a dollar tree i like to buy the little glitters because journey loves to do her nails as you're going to see in the video, honey, every time I pull out nails, makeup, anything, she is right there. Okay, so it's two different kinds you can use. Um, you can use like a pinkish with uh, glitter or you can use like a more clear with glitter. Okay, um, I'm going to show you both. I'm going to show you the clear with glitter. And excuse my lighting. Um, I was hoping that, you know, the light was would hit right <laughs> but i really can't tell in the video um so as i'm doing this voice over hopefully it does justice and you can see okay this is the one i went with fi i decided to use the clear with the um with glitter and here's a more pinkish um tone and then it has glitter in it too. It's very pretty, especially on French tips. On French tips, it's so, so pretty. But it just has a hint of pink. Um, and I just had that. So you can kind of see the difference. One is more like pinky, you know, pink and just pinkish. And I decided, no, because I, I literally just had my nails like that. So I wiped it off. And I decided to do all of them with the clear pink with this one um it's number 441 la colors um yeah so i think i got it from like the dollar tree not the dollar tree family dollar family family dollar dollar general or dollar tree it had to be one of them <laughs> okay because that's where i get all journey little polishes from but i like to use this on my uh french tips because like i said it hides the imperfections and you cannot tell at all whether you use the pink or the clear I also have a blue that has glitter in it too but these two are my favorite 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 and excuse me I got out of the shower and I did not put on lotion so I am like itching like crazy so that's why you see me putting on lotion and scratching but that's a whole nother thing that's a whole nother <laughs> that's something totally different but yeah so I'm just painting my nails and I think they turned out really good for $7.99 y'all 
All right, now you see me and Ginger nails. I told y'all she be on every scene with these little nails, honey. <laughs> and she did her own nails. She loved to do her nails. So, um, yeah, I'm just painting away here. And then what I do is um, I use a top coat as well. And side note, I was running out of top coat. Um, like a, see, you see the difference? You see what I mean? It looks flawless flawless for $7.99 y'all okay so then you're gonna cure your nails I do it for like 30 seconds um sometimes 60 seconds depending on how many layers I only use one layer I don't I, I never try to like to use a whole lot of layers I just use one layer and um and then I'll add the top coat now this is almost a well, y'all come for me in this, in this video my top coat i am running out of okay so i literally have to get real hood and ghetto and turn the bottle of top coat over in order to get the majority of it out it's still a lot in there but i have to literally turn the bottle over so just don't even judge me y'all just understand trust the process okay so this is how they're looking. So, like I said, I have to turn that bottle over, y'all. And get as much of it out as I could. Um, and, yeah. Once you put the top coat on there, baby, and you cure it, you're good to go. I put it under there. Um, I cure it for about 30 seconds. And then I'm good to go. But, y'all will see the end results. Alright, y'all. And this is the end results i have to bring it up closer so you can see the glitter hitting all over the place y'all see my ring so cute um but yeah shout out to my husband my little my ring i ain't gonna say little ring i think it's i mean i picked it out i love it i love it um anyways so yeah this is how my nails turned out only 7.99 i totally love it totally would recommend kiss acrylic nails catch you next time peace